him and I collected the boys, four and ten years of age, from school and headed home for the next portion of my day. The boys had baseball practice at six, so there wasn't much time for wasting. We had a schedule to stick to. We entered the home through the basement and continued up the stairs to eat, change and leave again. One day, my youngest, who was always running and was therefore the first to enter the house on the main floor, surprised me when he yelled back to us, We've been robbed, mommy! We went through the house taking inventory of the missing items, which included my son's bedroom suite, their PlayStation, and my husband's clothes. I didn't need the police to figure out who the prime suspect was. I was disgusted, angry, and pissed that my husband would take from our sons to go live with his new girlfriend. Who does that? I had to explain to my sons what happened so they would know they weren't brought by a stranger. Uh, hey baby, uh, you let me back in the house. Uh, I left I left my favorite remote to the TV. And you know, I, I can't watch my show if I ain't got that remote. It's called Getting Up Off the Couch. There's a knob. It says on and off. You can touch it once to turn it on, and then you can touch it again Come on, baby. to turn Come it on. off. I, I just got off the couch. Don't, don't, make, me, don't make me take a couple steps off the TV. You know, I can't handle that shit. There's another button. <laughs> CH, which is short for channel. Um, just in case, you might want to write that down on your hand in case you forget it. CH for channel, not for anything else, just channel. There's a plus and a minus. The plus is for more, the minus is for less. The plus is up, the minus goes down. CH is the channel, write that shit on your hand. <laughs> Come on, baby, you know, you're so smart. That's why, that's why I love you, baby. You're so smart. Come on, man. Just, just come down and just turn the TV on. Okay, brother, come on, please. There's another couple of minutes. It says VOL. That's short for something called volume, which you hear through your ears. VOL. Write that down on your hand. I, 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 the pen is in the kitchen. Can you go ahead and get it for me? <laughs> And then there's also another plus and a minus. <laughs> if you remember from the from the last thing I just told you, the plus is for more or up. The minus is for less or down. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Hello? Hey baby, I was got I was tired of standing up and yelling. <laughs> No, I heard what, kind of what you were saying, but I kind of tuned out because it was like some, it was a fast, the Merrill just passed through the house. I think it was my brother. But uh, uh, he coming over here for this game. You're going to have to come down and say all that shit you were saying, but we got to say it while, before the game come on because yeah, I got people coming over. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So there's another box. <laughs> and, um, it's, it's for TiVo, and that's when you can like record stuff. So if you guys just can't pick up on the volume thing and the channel thing and the on and off thing, maybe you can start working with the TiVo thing so you can watch the game that you're probably going to miss because you're not going to get up and turn on the TV. I just think you should be here. <laughs> I mean, that, that's what I want to do. <laughs> you know, and I just... When you're with someone for a really, really long time and you have kids with them, it's not as simple to just get up and walk out. You know, you have to have plans. You have to... Are you, are you transcribing everything that I'm writing now? Uh, yeah, I'm working on this new novel and... <laughs> I'm sorry, but your relationship's really fucked up, so I was thinking about adding it to my novel. You don't mind, do you? <laughs> you're supposed to be supporting me right now. And I understand it's difficult to do. It's like the same story over and over again. Every time we meet, it's like the same stuff, the same shit over and over again. You, can you say that again? I almost got the last <laughs> Same shit over and over again. <laughs> I'm sorry, um, you said the same thing like twice. That doesn't work well in the literature, so I'm gonna go back and go to, to, you know. You know, I'm so sorry. I'm you're my girl. Didn't say that. You are my girl. You are supposed to be helping me right now devise a plan to get the hell out of my house. Okay, girl. 
I got something for you. Okay. I got something for you, okay? My husband, he doesn't care when I leave the house, all right? So I'm going to steal some of my son's ninja clothes. <laughs> I'm going to clean your house for late at night, okay? I'm probably going to use the ladder and crawl down the roof. I want you to meet me. I'm going to send a line through through the uh, chimney. What? Pull it up, and you'll be out there. I was kind of thinking more along the lines of, like, could I crash uh, at uh, your place? Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> like, two weeks, you know, me and two boys, we can just you know, stay in the living room, you know, while I find another job. You know, what I have right now is only... That ninja's part was really good. That worked really good. <laughs> I'm okay? I'm sorry. This is some real life stuff, okay? He, he, I have to wait on him hand and foot. He, he, he doesn't do a damn thing. He doesn't do anything. Nothing? Nothing. Nothing? <laughs> How was he like before you married him? Hey, <laughs> baby! He helped me. I was, I got, I, <laughs> they said I was supposed to go to work today. <laughs> But I look, and it's like 20, 20 minutes, man, and that's too far. There's a thing called a car, right? <laughs> <laughs> and so what you're going to do is you're going to take this thing called a key, and you're going to open up the car, and you're going to sit yeah. in the driver's seat, and do you're going to turn it on. Do I have to buy the car? Uh -oh. uh, I would... That is a really bad story. <laughs> <laughs> this out there, but I think you are the dumbass for marrying me. <laughs> I would have never done that. My husband is, oh, he's so smart. He's an engineer. Um, he never pin, pays attention to me. I mean, he's always working. I love that. <laughs> so, he leaves you alone. You do your own thing. You spend his money. Mm -hmm. Hey, baby. I know you were working long hours and got something for you. You, you have to look at me. But you know, I'm doing something really sexual. <laughs> sweetie, okay, sweetie, I know you're not working in the corner. <laughs> Look at me for a second, okay? I worked long and hard on my nails, and uh, okay, you want to? <laughs> I know you can sleep. You, you've been working all day, okay? <laughs> See? <laughs> I'm a night in shiny armor. I'm kind of concerned for him. It sounds like he wants to get out. Bitch! <laughs> <Don't cry. laughs> Fine. <laughs> <laughs> almost got slapped. <laughs> <laughs> start writing down my own bullet stories. No, you can't do that. Hides in the corner. Does it look at nails? Never says she's pretty. <laughs> Won't even sleep in the same bed as her. <laughs>
ironically, the world is this country is really set up to keep women in bad marriages. I know. You know, like it's, we get paid less money mm -hmm. for the same exact job. Mm -hmm. You know, um, mm -hmm. if, if I our have clothes are way money. way cheaper made. Yeah, and they're way more expensive. You heard of a thing called the pink tax, where all of our like cosmetics and all of our razors and really? tampons. Why do we have to pay for tampons? I mean, that's something that happens to us. You know what I mean? Like, why is there a tax on tampons? <laughs> Uh, excuse me, ma'am. Uh, what's, 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 what's that in your What's that in your hoodie? Put it Put it out. What's, although, are you Are you still in tampon? <laughs> I get my period, okay? You just You No one's in here. <laughs> I get it, all right? Wow, blood comes out. It's cool. Yeah. All right. <laughs> and you know I spent thousands of dollars per my whole lifetime on these things? Really? Yes, thousands of dollars. Oh, shit. Sometimes I have to wear pads, too. You know what, my girlfriend? So you're not supposed to wear these things inside your body more than they ask because you can get something called toxic so uh, syndrome and then die. There's a lot of shit that happens to you as a female. <laughs> some extra ones so I can surprise my girlfriend so she don't have to pay I know she, she spends a lot of money and I don't want her trying to kill her. So you want me to see you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. I don't see you. Okay? That makes sense. Alright. Okay. <laughs> so she lets you just come in every week and steal tampons. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I always met him outside and then gave him lunch because he was also super afraid to walk into a store and put tampons on like the counter, because you know he was afraid whoever was running him up would be like, "Oh, you're whipped. You're putting on tampons for your girl." Beep beep. Beep beep. Four hundred dollars. Tampons are so expensive. They're four hundred. Oh my god. I know. Might as well be. When the stock market went up, tampons went up. <laughs> but it definitely did. Yeah. Okay. And do you know when you buy the or or organic kind that are nicer to your body, it's like a lot more money? I know. It smells so much better now. <laughs> Um, listen, I need you to leave. I oh, sorry, what <laughs> you know my song's all right now, so you is this song important? <laughs> do, we, do we need to talk? Because I hate when you guys say you need to talk. When you want your stuff to happen, you always talk to me. Baby, I need a TV on. Baby, I haven't eaten for six hours and I don't know how to cook. Cook me something. Baby, take care of your kid. I burned some... myself last time I tried to cook, okay? <laughs> I didn't know you can't take the boiled eggs out of the water. I thought you could just take them out. <laughs> how I ever fell in love with you. Sometimes in our 20s, we go through a period in our lives where as women, we just feel really shitty about ourselves and some, some guy comes along and, you know, some guy comes along and says, you know, like, oh, I'll pay attention to you for a few minutes, and you acted okay for like a month or two. You know, but knew how to drive for a month. You knew, like, what a paycheck was. You know, you didn't make me pay for everything in the beginning. I have a sneaky suspicion that you have been pretending this whole time. Because my confidence is back, okay? All right? I am 44 years old. I got my shit together. It's time for you to leave. I told you, it's, you hard, were, you it's were, hard finding a job out here, okay? You have a I'm, motherfucking master's. <laughs> And it's hard, okay? <laughs> they don't just hire any guy. <laughs> Trust me, I've been uh, to all of the interviews. No, they just don't hire any woman, but they will hire a man. So you need to get out and get your own job and get out of this house. Can I do it after? No. <laughs> I don't like to talk to me. I'm I don't care. 44 years old, my confidence is back. I was a stupid 20 something year old. That's it, it's done. Okay? Fine. All right? Fine. I'm even going to start stealing tampons. I feel so good about myself. <laughs> you should have been stealing tampons 20 years ago. I did the numbers. You know what I learned? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I learned works? What? This. <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Don't you just go put a corner on me, huh?
That's what you're gonna do? All right, I got something for you. Are you ready now to be cool? I've been cool. All right. I'm gonna give you an Are hour you to pack your shit. <laughs> that includes packing, getting it outside, getting it in a car that you're gonna remember how to drive. <laughs> now it's not. Someone else's house. You are not staying here anymore. The kids are tired of your stuff too. Dad's like a real piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he bought us a freaking PlayStation. He's always playing. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, oh, I forgot how to boil an egg, but I know how to get to the you 20th level. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> I, I'm gonna be honest, man. We, our dad is dumb as fuck. <laughs> or, or you know what I was thinking? What? He's the smartest motherfucker because <laughs> he gets mom to do everything. <laughs> All right, guys. I'm sorry. I see I got out of the house late. All right. <laughs> Sit on our wives while the game is on. I make my wife clean my ass when I'm drunk. <laughs> I don't know, guys. I thought, I thought 
thought when we came up with this plan in college, we were going to find low self esteem women to do everything. Oh my God. I didn't want to take it this far, guys. <laughs> but you know, this thing with them like turning 40? Fuck shit. It just fucks <laughs> up. Like, I know who I am. My wife busts in the house like fucking Superwoman. <laughs> you're gonna get the fuck out. You're gonna do every. And she planned every single detail. <laughs> Gave me an ETA of when I was gonna get the fuck out of my house. <laughs> 45 minutes. <laughs> Yo, something weird happens to women when they turn 40. Man. <laughs> Shanice, I don't know, I just woke up this morning. You're glowing. 40th birthday. You're glowing. <laughs> and, you know, I was 20 pounds slimmer. <laughs> and my skin was perfect, perfect, no wrinkles. And your hair is I love being 40. And you know what? What? I feel like I'm really smart right now. <laughs> <laughs> and like, let me ask you a question. And I know who I am. You know who you are? Yeah. Okay, let me ask you a question. How do you feel about your husband? He is a piece of shit. <laughs> 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 <laughs>